Mario Reaper Tomical Market episode 2, so let's get into this. So, this week's episode for Tomical Market, it was a good episode. I enjoyed it. Uh, you know, a lot of funny moments. You know, Tomiko in a bunny suit, freaking all day. Look, look, she look cute. She look cute. <laughs> I don't know. I, I really enjoyed it. It's a very feel good episode. Just, just relax. I, I enjoyed it. So, what happens in this episode is basically. Um, Tomiko wants the shopping district to become more Valentine's Day ish because Valentine's Day is coming, and so everyone starts jumping on board with this Valentine's Day idea, and everything's changing in the, val in, in the whole shopping district. And so the only person that's really like rejecting this whole idea was Tomiko's father. Though later on, he actually ends up you know doing it too because after he sees the whole shopping district change, he's like, oh my god, Valentine's Day, ah, oh, and stuff. And you know, it, it was pretty fun to see that. That was happening. Also, Monkey Zoe wanted to film a commercial for the shopping district for Valentine's Day as well. And so that's what they ended up doing. This is why Tamako and Kana, which is Tamako's friend, were in a suit. And yeah, so that's, that's really going on. They made the commercial. It all went well. They ended up having to view the commercial through Dara Monkey, Monkey Yucky, which is kind of odd. They put like, the thing in his mouth and then bam, they just started projecting you know, this image. Which, I mean, he's, I guess he's a projector apparently. He's a projector um, bird, I guess. Because, <laughs> I mean, he was projecting the image from the last episode as well, which which what we do get another hint of actually. Because after the whole commercial they, um, they filmed, we also end up seeing... Uh, the prince, I guess, again, he was just basically trying to talk to the birds, saying, this is nice over here, and, and say, yada, 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 basically. You know, small talk. And so that, that, that's another hint for something else. I'm looking forward to seeing where this is all going to go when it comes to that bird. But, you know, that's basically the end of the episode right there, because they, they end up, you know, getting chocolates and stuff. Midori, which is also another one of uh, Tomiko's friends, is like a very popular girl. All the girls like her. All the guys like her. So all the girls and guys were giving her freaking chocolates and stuff. So she's just like, what the heck? <laughs> so, yeah. So it, it, it was it was a nice little episode here, you know Valentine's Day is you know lovey dovey stuff. I, I I I enjoyed it. I'm just looking forward to more of this stuff. Cause I know this was this works was more for like the other characters of the show to give them give more development for some of uh, Tomiko's friends and stuff like that, so we know who they are and everything. And so I'm I'm just looking forward to seeing how this overall plot this show is gonna go. You know I want to see where it's all gonna where it's all gonna go exactly, especially with this bird, cause bird is very unique. Very different. A talking bird that can project freaking images out of its head. So I, I, I kind of want to know why he can do that and what's going on with this prince and what is what, like his prince like Indian ish. So I'm like, I'm, I'm like, who is this guy? You know what I mean? I just I want to see more of this. I wonder where this is all gonna go. Also, the bird is gonna be staying there until spring because that's when all the girls are supposed to be come, coming out and it'd be easier for him to find more girls. But he's a, what he's saying basically. So he's just too fat to fly. So he's not gonna <laughs> he's gonna have to wait. So. Yeah, and also he wants to stay with Tomoko too. So I just, I just want to know what this bird is all about. That's that's the main thing I want to see. So hopefully the story starts really picking up a little bit in the next couple of episodes. So, you know, there's going to be just more excitement going on. Because I do like the comedy in this though. So, you know, overall, I, I like this episode. I'm liking the show so far. I love the freaking ending. I can't wait for more. So leave your comments below and tell me what you think of the episode. Like it if you like this review. And subscribe to my channel if you want to see some more Tomoko Market reviews from me. So it's been the Breakmaster. And until then, break out.